know this, but I went to MagCon this weekend. And basically, if you don't want to know what it is, MagCon is basically a meet and greet event with a bunch of YouTubers and Viners. And it was so much fun. I went with my friends. And so basically this video is a bunch of clips that I've put together that I took at the event. A quick little summary of everything that happened so you're not confused by my videos because definitely a lot happened. And I know a lot of times in vlogs people just make enough that they can tell, like the vlogs tell what happened or the videos that they made. But um, my phone died during the event, so I didn't get to finish vlogging. So I'm just going to go ahead and kind of talk about it. Go ahead and enjoy all these clips that I put together. Into the VIP only event that was on Friday night. And so first we went to Taylor Kniff's line. We're in line. We're about to meet Taylor Kniff. I didn't even put it. Oh, yeah, I did. Sam was there too from O2L, which is our second life on YouTube, and we got to meet him and we took pictures with them. Let's go see Matt Espinoza and Sean Mendez. We went to go take pictures with JC Kaylin from O2L also. And after we took pictures with JC, we went to go take pictures with Jack and Jack. Oh, Jack and Jack, while we were waiting in their line, they gave the guys a break because they had been out there for like two and a half hours standing and smiling and taking pictures with people. So of course they needed a little break. So they took a break and we just kind of sat and were on our phones. And then they came back and we took pictures with them. And both of the Jacks kissed my cheek. It was, oh my god, I literally almost died. I was so happy at that moment. I love the Jacks. Sean sang some song, or a song. I don't remember what he sang. Jack and Jack, we went to go get Nash Greer's line, and I love Nash. He's so funny. He's also on Vine. And while we were waiting in Nash's line, of course, they were like, oh, MagCon's over for a Friday night, and we were literally two people away from meeting Nash. We were so sad, so we didn't get to meet Nash on Friday. So after MagCon was over, we went upstairs, and we all got dressed and went downstairs, got some food. And then it came back upstairs. No. Was that right? I don't know. Anyways, somewhere in between that whole thing, I had to go to the bathroom and change because my mom's like, you can't go downstairs in your pajama pants. So we went downstairs, and while we were downstairs, we saw Cameron freaking Dallas in the elevator. Like, we got out of the elevator and we saw him, and we were just like, and we didn't know what to do. We didn't want to bother him because he was obviously going up to his room. And we were like, he just had met all those girls and he was probably really tired. And so we just walked away and we were like, oh my god, it's Cameron. And then he was like, you guys don't want to take a picture? You can ride up with me and take one. And so we took a picture. And he was so nice. And he just like, he like, 
the elevator got to his floor and he walked out and then he walked back in to give us all hugs and it was so sweet oh my god I love Cameron and then um, on Saturday we woke up at like 8 30 and we all got ready and then we went to go wait in the line at probably 10 30 we're waiting in line and we're gonna be in this line for an hour and a half <laughs> natalie say hi to my face <laughs> hi there's a lot of people and it goes all the way up there and the snakes around and I'm just kind of being awkward. Yeah. We didn't line till like 12 o'clock and all these girls were screaming and freaking out because they saw the guys walking. And we're just like, you're about to meet them. Chill out. So yeah, after we dealt with those annoying screaming girls, we finally got let into the event only to wait for an hour. We went straight to Cameron's line because we didn't go in his line in VIP night because we were like, oh, it's really long. And so all of us VIPs were lined up really nice and awesome in this line. And then when and then they let priority admission in who got to go in 30 minutes after us and then they went into all their lines that they wanted to be in. And then um, they let general admission in and they started announcing people. While they were announcing people, um, everybody like pushed to the front of the stage and like here's the stage and Cameron's line was right here so all these girls like kind of got right next to Cameron's line and then after they were done announcing they all smushed together into our line and we were so mad literally we waited in that line for five oh, hours we're waiting in the line for Cameron Dallas we've been waiting for about five hours five hours and then we're just now trying to Yeah. How much we just waited in Cameron's line for five and a half hours. Okay, so basically all of us VIPs were waiting and waiting and waiting. In general admission, people had been just sneaking in and like priority people were sneaking in. And obviously VIP was going to be first because we got into the event first. So we were going to be in that line first. So they should have been able to tell who was cutting. And girls would just come in from the side and go into his line. And it was ridiculous. And there was this one girl and we totally saw her walk in and try and get in and my friend Tay was like um excuse you the back of the line's over there and she was like I've been in this line the whole time and we're like oh that's funny because you have an orange bracelet so you haven't and she was like whatever and so Taya started throwing quarters at her and like change and literally we started this whole revolution and they had to make Cameron leave so that we'd all get into a line because it was literally, I was so squished, I started hyperventilating because I get really badly claustrophobic around a bunch of people and I was about to pass out and all these girls were like, oh my god, this girl's about to pass out, y'all need to move. And they're like, no, I want to meet Cameron, I'm not going to move. And it was just ridiculous and it was really scary and like security wasn't doing anything. We told three people and they just did absolutely nothing and so... Finally, we just, like, we're like, we need to find somebody to help us. And we finally found someone. And then after waiting five and a half hours, we got to meet Cameron. And Cameron was so sweet. But they were like, you can only take one picture with him. And we thought he couldn't sign anything. So I didn't get him to sign my MAG concert. And it was really sad. But he was really nice and really sweet. And I could tell he wanted to spend more time with his fans. And it was just awesome. Cameron! 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 I love him. So after that whole mess, we went over to Nash's line, and we met some really awesome girls, and their names are Sarah and Ashley. It's also Ashley's birthday today, and mine, and so we hung out with them in Nash's line, and I love Ashley. She was, like, telling all these girls who were trying to cut Nash's line, just, like, leave. Yeah, we met Nash, and Nash was really nice. And then after Nash... We went to Taylor's line, and Taylor kept leaving for like 30 minutes, and so we waited in his line for a really long time, and during that whole time, we met Aaron Carpenter's brother, which I think his name is Nick, and so we took pictures with Nick, and Nick was really nice, and we finally met Taylor again, because we all love Taylor, so we took another picture with him. I got my eyes on you.
telling the truth I did what didn't kill me Never made me stronger at all Well, I always got your makeup, lipstick to me So now I'm really laid back in I'm sad, yeah, wishing I was sober No one ever called you like you used to And then after that, we had been there for like seven and a half hours and we had only met three people and we're like this is ridiculous on VIP night we met like six people in two hours so yeah then we just went back to our room and we had pizza and then we went downstairs and we talked to Sarah and Ashley we saw them again and that's when we figured out we were birthday buddies and then all the guys got over the balcony and they started like laughing and talking with us and it was really fun and jack johnson with the blonde hair and jack and jack he threw us down this like penguin balloon and he was like take off the feet so it'll flow back up and it was really fun and they were just like messing around with us and it was awesome uh, oh yeah and cameron spit his gum down and natalie went to go try and find it and it was really funny and then after that our parents were like y'all have to come back to the room so we accidentally went to the ninth floor and we saw them and they were all because that's the floor they were staying on they all looked out at us and it was like we were all screaming like as the elevator doors closed we screamed so loud and then we went back to our room and then today which is Sunday um, we got up we like got ready for the day and then we went downstairs to go get some food and we saw Matt um, and then, um, like, we were going back up to our room. He was coming down onto the first floor. And then we closed it. And Taya just sat there. And she was just like, ah! And Natalie, like, was covering her mouth. And we're like, Taya, oh, my God. You screamed so loud. And then she was like, let's go back down to the first floor. I was like, we have to check out at 12. We can't. And so we went back up there. And we saw Matt, like, a couple other times as we were leaving the hotel. And we, like, screamed a bunch of times. Yeah. On the way home from MagCon. And we're all very sad. What? <laughs> and Natalie says she looks bad today. And there's my mommy and my sister. And there's me. I probably look really stupid because I'm doing bad camera. Yeah. Taya Rollins, how was this weekend for you? It was great. What was your favorite part? Meeting Taylor Kniff. <laughs> Natalie, how was this weekend for you? You have to answer. Natalie, okay, I'll get it off your face if you just answer. Okay, it's off your face. Answer. It's on my face. It's not over. It's still happening. It's still happening. <laughs> she said it's not over. It's still happening if you couldn't hear. Yeah. My favorite part? What was your favorite part, Natalie? Cameron. Cameron Dallas. Later. Oh, no, I liked when Cameron spit his gum on. That card was just so much fun. And I literally, I love it. I want to go back. Ah, sorry this video was long. But yeah, if y'all like this, please like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. Bye, guys.